Hi crafters, this is Dennis McDonald up here and with another one of his crafting videos, The Chronicles of the Dragon's Den. The Dragon's Den is my little design, game design, gaming, and crafting studio that I have that, that, that is where all these broadcasts are coming from. Anyhow, uh, today's, I'm really excited about today's project. I'm going to show you how to make these really cool firewells for your dungeons. And yes, they do light up. And uh, I don't know if you can see them very good on the camera. But these are really cool. They're easy to make. And they look great. And they really bring some light and fire to your dungeon. So, for, for right now, what you're going to need for the next step. There's, there, the next step is, you're going to need one of these tea lights, which you can buy at uh, Walmart or Hobby Lobby or wherever. They're pretty cheap. Get them for like $79, $0.80 cents a piece or whatever. And they make sure it works. Make sure it works. And uh, a, a two inch piece of the blue foam material, which is I did in the original videos earlier. And that's, I bought this out, it's a camping pad you buy at Walmart. It's got a stone texture to it, it's real easy to work with, it's light. And uh, it's, I, I really enjoy working with it. I mean, it's really uh, added uh, a new dimension to my crafting. And you're also gonna need a two inch piece of one ply cardboard, or you can use a cereal box cardboard, or you can just use cardstock. I like one ply because it's a little more solid adds a little more weight to it and you're going to need your exacto knife and a marking pen and don't don't forget to fire up your wood burning tool and your hot glue gun so uh whilst we're going to get right to the next step we're going to make firewells for the dungeon see you on the flip side <laughs> 